good morning friends um welcome to my channel and um yesterday was my daughter's birthday party and i took that avenue to make puff puff in bulk uh-huh today i'll be sharing with you guys how to make party style puff puff this one is not any out puff puff but this one is the kind of puff puff you would you know want to make for an event ceremony parties okay i'll quickly take you guys through how it went okay and um i'm outside because i'm actually running away from my kids hmm. <laughs> and i've been i've been trying to film for a while now and each time i set the camera something just pop up so let's say you've been trying to make party style puff puff or bulky puff puff this video is for you okay so stay tuned while we you know move into the business into the business So guys, I weighed 2 kg flour, 400 grams of sugar, 1 teaspoon of baking powder, and 2 tablespoons of yeast plus 2 teaspoons of yeast. And this is the kind of yeast I'm using, okay? And I'm also adding one teaspoon of salt this is milk flavor and this is the kind of milk flavor i'm using there are two different brands here and i'm using both okay I'll also be grating one small nutmeg seed. And what I'm adding now is toasted coconut. I also have the link to that video. At the description box I'll also be dropping it at the end of this video I actually made that toasted coconut myself and that is what I use in decorating my daughter's birthday cake so make sure you check that out okay I still have lots of recipes coming up on my channel and you don't want to miss out on any of it please subscribe if you haven't like my videos and hit that notification bell so you would be notified whenever I upload a new video, okay? The sieve I was using initially wasn't helping matters because, you know, there are bigger particles in this flour, the sugar, the coconuts, and I had to transfer into a bigger basket and it actually did the job. And that is one tablespoon of vanilla extract. Okay, I'm topping that with water to get the accurate measurement of water that goes into the flour. I added a total of six cups of water. That is 1,500 milligram of water. Adding more water than necessary will only make your puff puff to soak oil when you are frying it, okay? But let it be firm so that you'll be able to mold that 
in shape when you are frying it okay You mix it till the dough becomes light and stretchy and when it rises it becomes lighter than the initial time I've been kneading the dough for roughly 15 minutes and I'm okay with this consistency. I'll cover it and keep it in a warm place. Okay guys, let's say you want to make puff puff for one person. I also have that recipe in my channel and the link to the video is at the description box, also at the end of this video. Please make sure you check it out, okay? Thank you. After 1 hour 30 minutes, the dough has risen tremendously and it is ready for frying. The stretchiness of the dough makes it easy to manipulate, that is, forming it into a round shape. And it also prevents it from scattering when frying. If you notice, I'm frying my puff puff slowly on a medium to low heat because my puff puff is a big size puff puff, okay? I'm really happy with this temperature. In my previous video, you guys saw how I was struggling with the temperature and um, but for this one, I guess I've learned my lesson so the temperature was perfect for the frying and everything came out the way i wanted it okay so guys this is my first fry hmm it looks so nice okay
so guys let me show you what the inside looks like it is dry in the outside and soft in the inside the inside of this puff puff did not soak oil at all okay this is what it looks like and i believe that's the way it should be okay hmm you can imagine serving hot puff puff with a chilled coca-cola enjoy so guys this recipe actually made 75 pieces of big size puff puff but if you are making small chops puff puff you will definitely have above 100 pieces okay thank you so much for your time and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel like my videos please and um <laughs> click the notification bell share my videos to your friends okay thank you bye bye i'll see you in my next video make sure you subscribe thank you so much